The Philippines is reportedly looking to enhance its defense capabilities by acquiring the U.S.-made Typhon Mid-Range Capability MRC missile system. Developed by Lockheed Martin, the Typhon system is known for its versatility and long-range operational capabilities, making it a critical addition to the Philippines' defense arsenal, especially as tensions in the Indo-Pacific region continue to rise. The Typhon MRC is a cutting-edge ground-launched missile platform capable of deploying the standard Missile 6 SM-6 interceptor. Originally designed for naval use, the SM-6 offers an impressive operational range of over 482 kilometers, allowing it to target a variety of threats, including aircraft, missiles, and even ships at sea. The Typhon MRC's mobile launch system provides the Philippines with flexible long-range land attack capabilities, a crucial upgrade in the country's defense strategy. What makes the Typhon MRC stand out is its ability to launch multi-role missiles like the SM-6, which excels in air defense, anti-ship missions, and precision land strikes. The system could also be compatible with other advanced munitions in the future, such as the Precision Strike Missile, PRSM, with a range of 500 kilometers, significantly boosting the Philippines' ability to defend its maritime interests. Looking even further ahead, the Typhon system's modular design could potentially allow it to deploy the Tomahawk cruise missile, extending the missile's range from 500 to 1,500 kilometers. This would give the Philippines a potent long-range strike option allowing for precision attacks deep into contested areas, including the South China Sea. The integration of Tomahawk missiles would transform the Typhon system into a powerful multi-theater platform, providing the Philippines with enhanced deterrence and strategic reach. The Philippines' interest in the Typhon MRC comes at a time when regional tensions are intensifying, especially in the South China Sea, where territorial disputes are ongoing. With its impressive range, the Typhon system would offer the Philippines a strong defensive capability, helping to secure its maritime boundaries and establish a protective bubble over contested zones. This would be a significant step up from the country's current missile and artillery arsenal. In October 2023, the United States deployed the Typhon MRC system to the Philippines as part of joint military exercises. This marked the first operational use of the system on Philippine soil, demonstrating the system's rapid deployment capabilities and enhancing the Philippines' ability to defend its interests. During these exercises, the armed forces of the Philippines gained invaluable experience in operating the system and improving interoperability with U.S. forces. The potential acquisition of the Typhon MRC system also signals a deepening defense relationship between the Philippines and the United States. As part of the Enhanced Defense Cooperation Agreement, EDCA, the Typhon system could play a key role in strengthening the U.S.-Philippine alliance and supporting collective security efforts in the region. Though the Philippine government has not yet made a final decision, the potential acquisition of the Typhon system would mark a major step in the country's defense modernization efforts. The deployment of these missile units would enhance the Philippines' ability to protect its maritime and territorial interests, with training and logistical support provided through U.S.-Philippine defense cooperation channels. By acquiring the Typhon MRC, the Philippines would not only strengthen its sovereignty in contested regions, but also enhance its overall defense posture. The system would be a critical asset in safeguarding the country's maritime territories against emerging threats, signaling a commitment to regional stability and defense modernization as key pillars of the Philippines' national security strategy. If the acquisition moves forward, the Philippines will be better equipped to counter future threats, ensuring its position as a strong regional player in the Indo-Pacific.